Hey guys, welcome back to another cleaning video. Today we are going to do a deep clean in the bathroom. We had so much to get done in today's video. I scrubbed the tub twice. I even scrubbed around the toilet on the floor. And I wanted to take you guys along with me as I scrub the heck out of this bathroom. So if you are new, welcome, my name is Rosa. And I am gonna bring you some nasty stuff. Not only did I scrub the tub, I also cleaned out the drain. And I don't show you exactly, but you do get a little glimpse of it. It was so disgusting. It was all of my hair. <laughs> it was all of my hair that uh, was down this drain and I needed to get it out. I needed to clean this tub. Um, but I not only use a, I think it's shower clean is what my husband has up here in Ohio and also some Ajax, but I went back in with the Dawn Power Wash and you guys, that stuff is amazing. If you have yet to try it on any, if you have yet to try this product on any form of surface cleaning, such as your tub and your shower, you guys, you have to. It is amazing. It does such a great job. Um, all you need is just a little bit of elbow grease to get down into the, the crevices and, uh, and, and to some of the hard parts of the tub, but it comes up so well. And on top of that, your bathroom smells great while you're cleaning it. So um, again, if you're new, welcome and welcome back, you guys. Your love, your support means um, just it's, it means uh, the world to me. And I, I cannot uh, thank you guys enough for being here. Um, but as I said, today we're just cleaning out the tub. We're cleaning out this bathroom. We're scrubbing the floors. You guys, I scrubbed the floors with, it, uh, what is it, a sponge? The abrasive side of the sponge. Scrubbed the floors, y'all. Scrubbed it. Well, not all of it, but behind the toilet. And then I used our new mop to clean up the shower, or to clean up the floors. So let's get into today's video. If you're needing the motivation to get up and clean that bathroom, or clean a bathroom, or clean, or just clean something, then I hope that today's video provides that for you. Taking all my time 
Once I had scrubbed around the toilet on the floor, um, again, I just want to make sure that we, or I didn't miss anything, because sometimes when you're mopping the floor, it doesn't get behind it in the areas that truly needs to get scrubbed down. And I will have to say, I did use a lot of product. It was very strong in here. I had to uh, get the fan to help circulate some of the air and also turn on the, ant, the fan to get it all out. Um, if you're wondering what do I put in my toilet bowl scrubber, the bowl itself, I put pine sol in there um, just to kind of help with the smell in there and also that the toilet bowl brush doesn't stink. So uh, that is what I put in there. Um, but once all of the all of this was scrubbed out, I noticed that we didn't need all of this crap junk back in the bathroom. This little caddy worked great when I needed it, but quite honestly, we could put that in uh, the closet where all the cleaning products are and just get it off the bathroom floor. And funny enough, when the hubs came home, he's like, wait a minute, something's missing. Like there's things that were gone and it was the caddy that took up a lot of space. Uh, and so once all of that is done, we'll then move over to the sink and get that all nice and clean. Life into your muscles, instinct for the living man. However, oh, there is one thing you're all forgetting. But in this morning, we'll turn to night. And when you're dreaming, you will be seeing a little demon dancing around. Baby, there is only one way, and that's the slow decay.
So after cleaning out the sink and scrubbing it out, you guys, I, a, a dirty sink drives me crazy, but it's always so difficult to keep it up after so many people um, using it. But here I noticed that the soap was not only uh, running low, but two, the, um, whatever the twist cap on this was cracked. And um, I know that we have a soap dispenser in uh, the kitchen, so I brought that in here. And quite honestly, even though I try to separate the two here in Ohio, with both the hand soap and also the dish soap. Everyone uses the dish soap for the hand soap. So I might as well have just brought it into the bathroom so that um, we can just use it all. And it was the perfect amount of soap you guys will see here. Like literally the very last drop was to the top. It was, it was so funny. Um, but I brought this in here so that we can use this in here. Um, and one, it looks nicer in here. It's not so clustered and or cluttered over by the kitchen sink. But uh, once this is all wiped down and clean, then we're going to go back into mopping the floor. Well, hanging up a new drying towel and then uh, mopping the floor and then cleaning the hallway that got messy. As always, <laughs> when I clean up one area, another gets messy. So we're going to go ahead and take care of that next. So we are just about done with today's video and here we are in the hallway cleaning it all up. I'm going to show you where I'm going to put the caddy. You guys, without this in the bathroom, the littlest things make a huge difference. Uh, the littlest things, I tell you. So without this caddy, it looks so much better and next to the toilet, it's not so cluttered or clustered or whatever. It's not overwhelming. and. As you guys can see, Ruby Roo, Ruby Girl, she wants to see everything and wants to be in the middle of everything. And when you guys see this video, I am already home. Been home for about a week, but I still have more videos to bring to you from Ohio. So you guys will get a little bit more of Ruby Roo, but here shortly, uh, she won't be in the videos anymore. And I absolutely miss her and love her so much. But oh man that girl is a maniac but i want to thank you guys so much for being here and i hope that today's video <laughs> as you guys saw he's such a, a weirdo the hubs is such a weirdo but i hope that today's video 
brings you so much motivation and inspires you to do a little something. And I hope that you guys enjoyed today's music. Um, everything is new and I wanted a different feel, a different vibe, and I hope you guys got that. So uh, if you cleaned with me, let me know what you cleaned. If you sat back and enjoyed, let me know what you did. Did you enjoy some coffee, tea, uh, an adult beverage? Because if you guys haven't noticed in the past couple of videos, yes, I've been enjoying uh, a sparkling spiked seltzer or adult beverage of of a beer of some sort because you know what I'm entitled to that I'm entitled to at least one or two or three or four depending on the mood right anyway well I hope you guys enjoy today's video uh, let me know where you're watching from uh, if you are new please I hope you do consider subscribing and joining our growing community and uh, hit that like button don't forget to hit the notification bell so that you are notified when videos are posted so thank you guys so very much for being here and I'll see you in the next one much love and God bless.